everybody, this is Luke Darnall back with another video. Um, sorry, once again, unfortunately, you guys are gonna have to get used to this uh, lower quality audio for the time being until I kind of work out some finances and work out a better um, rig here um, with audio and stuff. So, um, with that said, let's go ahead and get into this. Um, so, uh, I just really wanted to jump on here quickly. I know LA Union um, and Jordan Brand collaboration, we've seen it many times. Um, you know, but you know, we have to wait every so often, every period to get this whole wave um, of new merch or shoes or whatever they're doing. Um, and it's usually, there's been so much dope stuff in the past and I just kind of want to jump on here and give you guys my honest thoughts, what I'm gonna definitely be going for around the gate. Um, I'll just be upfront about it. I ain't going for those shoes. Even though I love those shoes, I'd probably go for those navy ones, but I'm not just a blue guy in general. I'm pretty selective. Um, as a whole when it comes to blue but i definitely like throwing different colors in a rotation or in the mix of everything um so yeah we'll just go ahead and get into it um let me go ahead and slide uh my my little head off to the side here again you know my setup ain't the best right now um but i i i'm pretty hyped for this merch um so here's um you know the website la union uh, or the union los angeles.com site um store and uh they're kind of you know kind of showing off or uh styling a lot of the pieces of clothing dropping here um which is kind of weird looking it's almost as if you took a couple young people and tried to made them look older but it's whatever i don't know if that's legit or that's what they're targeting. I don't know, it's cool though. Let's just jump to the merch. Um, so, this top row, um, a lot of people were comparing like these jackets to like the the Asian people, they have jackets, which yes, I, um, I, I definitely connected with that too. Um, but more so when I first look at this, it has space astronaut, uh, space astronaut vibes. Um, it looks crunchy like that. I mean, we all grew up some, with some space movies, a lot of Disney stuff, and uh, I forget that one girl, you know, that, you know, I forget her name, but she, I don't know, I don't even know why I'm going off on that. But for some reason, this strikes me as like space wear, <laughs> so astronaut stuff. Um, let's go ahead and wrap this. A little distracting. Um, so I'm passing, um, especially, I mean, this collaboration is going to be premium priced. That's how it is. I mean, it's going to be somewhat reasonably priced, but it's going to, it's not like sh shit you'd find at Kohl's, Walmart, you know, Target. It's premium. It's collaboration. It's sought after. I think it's dope too. It should be premium, but I guess what I'm, I'm stressing here is you have to consider that it has to be you know stars have to learn a line for you to want to invest in something like this because they're charging premium pay um so don't get fomo be objective based know what you want um it's a very good uh sustainable habit to get into don't want to just fomo unless you're trying to flip some profit a lot of this you can definitely flip um i'm just gonna all right so that first pro is just astronaut vibes it looks like you know you shoot me off uh, um and i'll be living in a ship for a while um that's just kind of the vibe I get. The hoodies, um, they're just hoodies. I have plenty of hoodies. Um, they kind of, you know, it's a chill vibe, but it's a vibe that I don't want all the time, especially in the summer and spring, summer, and into the fall. I'm in construction, so I like, I don't know, I, I feel more freed up when I don't have the damn hoodie. Kind of, It kind of gets my way. Um, and I, I like crew necks a lot too because I mean all year round if I'm if I'm moving, boxing up sneakers or just I have a busy day ahead that hood can fucking get my way. Um, but I also love the the vibe of a hoodie. Everyone likes that hoodie. It's cozy. It's chill. Um, but I'm passing on both those. If I were to pick, I'd get this uh, this gray or cool grayish. Hey boy. Um, kind of. Uh, colored uh sweatshirt that gold is a little too gold it's a little too rich in color um 
And then this next piece is the piece that I will certainly be going for. This is going to be my bread and butter. Or, you know, it's, I'm going to make it my bread and butter, hopefully. Um, but I love the vibe of this. Um, I don't have a color like this either, especially crew neck. Um, I think it's such a, a chill elegance and grace and mainly just class modesty you know this is kind of what I um, I kind of like live to to or aim to be kind of like the vibe like I love like the, the old school saxophone um, R&B player who play at shows they're always just so damn wise relaxed open-minded um, intelligent folk um, and they're very humble so I, I kind of you know, I, I kind of yearn to be, you know, as, as modest and wise. And, uh, you just have that depth. So this is just class to me. Um, especially, I mean, you can convey class and you can own class and modesty on your own, wearing whatever you want. But I really like to uh, let my clothes reflect how I feel, how I want to be or who I am, hopefully, um, who I'm being at the time. So this is definitely... A, the item um, of the whole collaboration that I love. Of course, you tailor uh, your vision or you um, tailor your criteria or, you know, you, you make it fit you, man. So out of what I'm seeing here, this is by far what calls to me. I know, no doubt I'm gonna love this. So I'm gonna try to cop a medium for sure. Thankfully, mediums usually have the most bulk. So I'm hoping, I'm hoping, man. But uh, I've never taken it. I've never gotten a W on Union collab. It's insane. I'm always pretty pissed. Um, so this one's pretty fire too. But like I said, it's blue. It kind of draws a little too much attention. I like to be chill in the background. Uh, but it's cool. Um, the the blue pants over the gold for sure. Because uh, this gold is just. Well, let me talk about this blue since it's not jumping over um but i love the patching on the bottom leg it's just vintagey it's just nice it's a nice slow and steady vibe that's how i see it um and then yeah all the all the gold pieces um they're just a little too loud and deep and rich and with that gold color so it's they're still nice articles of clothing like don't get me wrong um it just doesn't fit what i'm kind of heading to what i want to portray myself as I guess um but back to this you kind of like faded pastel is uh, creamy um yeah color I love this vibe but I'm good on the shorts um but this is fire too um let's see and then all right so my first item is this I really hope um you know this is like that's why I try to cop as I I'm always trying to make money in general um so I can fund shit that I really want, but you have to be very selective on what you, you want, you know? I'm gonna get my money's worth out of these things I spend my money on, I know that. Um, so I'm blessed and instilled with, you know, that that uh, awareness and habit. Um, but yeah, this is my number one. I really hope I, I take a, a W on that uh, and cop it. And then number two, um, it was either b between this Michael Jordan classic, but I mean, I'm almost a bit tapped out on Michael Jordan, like, kind of stuff. I think it's a little overdone to me personally right now, but I probably own at least a couple pieces of some, you know, Michael Jordan stuff. So I'm a little tapped out on that. Um, so I'm good on this. And I already got like one or two crew neck black. So I'm good on it, but I do like the vibe for sure. Um, but I think personally my number two is probably this because uh, it, it, yeah it's kind of like that cool gray but it's 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 still very subtle um, and I don't have a lot of like this is a pretty kind of like specialized color gradient going on here you know it's not really gray it kind of looks like a little blue tinge in, in the mix of it um, so I really like it um, and I love Obviously, like, a, a lot of these pieces of clothing have, like, this wornness to them. Um, so, on, the, like, the edges and trims. Obviously, that's the vibe. So. Um, and then, probably 
third or fourth um, is obviously this black, but I already got a lot. This is gonna fly like crazy. Um, it, this is definitely the best t-shirt. Um, so this one, you're taking a risk if you're gonna go for this. Half the shoes, your best bet is go for it immediately. Um, but I still think it'll fly because it's a dope, it's a dope shirt. It's just I'm good on that. I like to be a little different anyway. So, so yeah, those are my like top four items, I guess. Number one, this crew neck, I absolutely love it. I think it's OG. Um, so I really hope to cop that one. And then secondly, uh, I'm gonna go ahead and put this cool gray key. I think it's cool. I think it's a little different. Um, but it's also subtle, so I like it. Um, and then number three, the Michael Jordan crew neck in black. Uh, that white doesn't quite do it for me. Um, so it, it's just a little too loud. And it's gonna hurt my eyes looking at this shit. So, uh, and then number four is this black t-shirt, which is absolutely fire. But I'm good on it. I already have one of these. I have it like an older one without the jump man. Um, so, you know, the little skateboarder guy. And, like, I like these skateboarding tees or whatever. Like, I just always think he's doing a free flip or, you know, some, some or jumping down stairs or a, a flip trick off of stairs. Um, I don't know what the halo is right here over his head, but, um, yeah, he's, for me, I just think it's obvious he's doing a skate trick. Um, so, like, these t-shirts are cool, but I'm not really trying to, I kind of associate with like, I don't know, a punk skater if I'm seeing it. So maybe I'm just twisted or got it twisted up there, but I'm good on those tees because it's just like, you know, a dude doing a trick. So, but if I were to pick one, shit, I guess I'd have to go with this one first because <laughs> I like that color. Um, and then cool gray second. So, um, and the socks are pretty sweet. I mean, both socks are cool because they got like this tag. I mean, it's so vintage -y. So I love it. Makes the sock. Makes a lot of these pieces of clothing having that little tag on it. It's beautiful. But I'm not sure if I'd cop one. If I were to cop one, I'm not sure. I'm just not even gonna cop them. <laughs> Honestly, I'd rather save my money. Um, and the hats, I'm good on the hats. I like black hats. Um, cause I don't, you know, black, a black hat goes with fucking anything, so I'm not trying to start a hat collection, no thanks, um, but they're cool too, um, if I were to pick one, I guess I'd have to go with this one, you guys already know the vibe, I like this, this aged creamy look, so, um, and then number two, probably the gold, finally, cause it's kinda Laker, ish to me yeah and then finally at the bottom we got these uh got these shoes so uh the sandals are trash um they're not for me uh but i mean if you like them go for them but if i were to rate i had got enough creamy creamy ish kind of shoes especially after getting the new balance uh ma uh, Leon Dor 650Rs, if you haven't checked that video, check it out. I really like those. They're so retro-ish. Um, I'm really digging them. The shoe makes you retro for sure. Um, but, uh, yeah, I'm good on that middle pair. Um, and that, that I would get the blue one and the cool gray. I think that's that's fire. But, like, I'm, I'm good on these, though. Like, it's really just, like, prioritizing shoes in general when it comes to this. Like, if I was... A legitimate collector I would definitely want this blue pair well shit I'd probably want both these pairs honestly if I was a collector um, but I would wear the shit out of this cool gray and blue one so that's what I would choose oops I zoomed in pretty bad there so they're fire the fire shoes I really like them I don't know where the hates come from but I love the silhouette from the side and everything they're definitely old school um, so I like them both but I like the blue I think a blue hits better and um, then, yeah, this is just a lot of people rocking. See, like, when I look at pictures like this, I never see people dressing like this, but I'm not in a big city. Um, so, I just don't, I can't relate to the culture. 
so maybe I'm like way behind the curve, but I just go with the flow from what I, people that I see, I guess, and use my best judgment, but yeah, I'll definitely be going for this, so wish me luck, guys, and good luck uh, with uh, anyone who's trying to cop one of these pieces of merch or the shoes, um, make sure, like, you totally peaceful before that the gates open, right at, you know, whatever time it's starting here Friday, um, cause it's gonna be nuts, it's gonna be sporadic as hell, people are gonna be hiking the fuck out of this, so I wouldn't, maybe just, like, educate yourself on, you know, through various YouTube channels, um, videos, and kind of get the latest updates or the latest information on the swiftest, most effective ways to give your chances or heighten or raise your chances of copying um and then just don't keep those live streams up when you're trying to cop though because that shit is just gonna skew that shit's just bringing emotion to your world um sometimes i fuck with live streams because it's fun i mean i do a lot like what if i got downtime anyways and i like a lot of streamers too but um when it comes to go time with me trying to like execute i'm not trying to get fomo'd and uh or this is FOMO's not the issue but like some like my emotions you know I, I become part of the pack too and uh it's not a good it's not a good uh thing because you're probably you, ha you it just increases your odds of fucking up because your emotions come in as simple as that so yeah hope you guys enjoyed the video I know I kind of forced this uh out of nowhere but you know this kind of crept up on me as well today's a rain day um so uh we're not working and uh, I'll be on later for the Supreme, just spitballing our, you know, I got, you know, some good buddies that come in the stream, and we'll uh, just kind of share ideas and what we're going to cop, and, um, or what, you know, we think, uh, and if I'm even going to cop, I'll let you know, though, I want those magnets, I'll give you guys that, so yeah, um, stay tuned, I hope to see you guys later for the Supreme, if not, I'll see you around on here. Um, I love merch, uh, or, you know, but you gotta be selective, man, we ain't trying to go broke, that's, uh, but yeah, uh, thanks a lot, everybody, Cheers.